and I ask you the same problem, but now we're pulling it at an angle. You know what? I'm going to change this to two pounds now. If F is two pounds, will the block move? So I'm going to ask the same questions. I don't have to rewrite them. So same questions. If F is two pounds, will the block move? If yes, what is A? What does F mean to make it move? If F is one pound, so A, same exact stuff. Okay, now, the thing with this that makes it harder is because you're pulling it at an angle, right? That means you're giving it a lift. So the normal force is no longer equal to 8. The sum of n plus f sine 35 is equal to 8, right? So, because a lot of people always, because... Um, n is so often equal to the weight is that you get used to saying n equals mg, but it's not always equal to mg, you know, see? So for this problem, we got to erase this, and we got to set it up this way. Uh, I'm going to do, do part b again here. n plus f sine of 35, n plus f sine 35 equals uh, 8. So you see that's the normal force here, plus the vertical component of F, okay? And then the horizontal component is going to be F cos 35. Must equal to uh, mu S n. Mu S equals 0.3. So if this happens, then the system will move. If the two vertical components, the two vertical forces equals eight, and the horizontal force equals uh, the friction, the system will move. So now to solve this, you can uh, substitute this n into this n. You get uh, F cos 35 equals 0.3 times uh, eight minus F sine 35. So I took this over to the other side, substitute it into the bottom end, and then I factor this in, uh, factor this in, so take it to the other side. There's a little bit of algebra you have to do here, right? You end up with F cosine 35 plus 0.3 sine of 35 equals 2.4. I distribute this and I take it over to the other side. So for, for now, let's just solve this and then we'll do the rest of the problem uh, later on. So just let, give me what F min is. That's going to give you the minimum force you need to make it move. Two point. What was the minimum force needed in the other problem? Um, Two point, what was that one? 2.4? This one is a 2.42? Oh, that's so close. This one is a little harder to move because you're moving it uh, at an angle here. Okay, good. So we'll continue this problem then next time. We'll do the other parts.